Hey, you guys. I know I've been so neglectful. I'm so sorry. Ignore my charger. <laughs> I have been so neglectful. I'm so sorry, y'all. I really, really am. Like, I have not been... <sighs> I have not been good. I have not been good with this at all. Um, it's not that I've been tired. It's not anything like that. But I think I told you guys before that I'm having, like, family issues with my mom. So, I'm like focusing on trying to get her situated in her new apartment and everything like that trying to take care of her and get her out the way um i'm still pregnant everything is fine baby still moving shaking doing great i did in my progesterone and in, in oil injections i did in those and i am actually doing really good with that um i was a little worried at first about getting off of those i know and listen i am on my phone so i am gonna be a little bit of everywhere i didn't want to set up the camera i didn't want to you know get it all whatever you know what i'm saying i just got back from uh in service um with my job it was a two-day long in service <sighs> for some training and um it's a lot so Let's just get to it. Cool? So, um, I am today 10 weeks and four days. Okay, so I turn 11 weeks Thursday. Tomorrow is Wednesday. So, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So, I'm like... Thursday. Hold on, y'all. Don't judge me because I ain't even... Ain't gonna be no editing. So, Thursday... Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So, I'm 10 weeks and 5 days. So, I'm 10 weeks and 5 days today. I turn a new week every Thursday. So, this Thursday, I'll be 11 weeks. Um, I've stopped my progesterone and oil. I got past, because usually when I stop my progesterone from past experience, when I stop it on that third day is when I get my period. Um, I have not had any bleeding. I have not had any spotting. I have, my body is doing exactly what my body needs to do. And I'm so proud. Good job, boo. I'm so proud of my body for doing exactly what it needs to be doing right now. So my body is doing what it needs to be doing. Um, no spotting. I do. I have like today I had some cramps and I do be having cramps from time to time. By the way, today is July 13th. 2021 it's the 13th today and um i don't go back to the doctors for like another week or so or something like that but we're getting through this week this week has been so fast for me like is this week has been by fast i only have one day off this week y'all because of this damn two day in service i only have one day off um the nausea I don't want to say it subsided, but it's more mild than what it was before. Like, it kicked up. And then, like, I never vomited. Knock on wood. Mm -mm. <laughs> I never vomited, but I would get really bad nausea. Like, I would get really bad nausea where my stomach would hurt. It would be turning. And I would feel like absolute crap. Like, definitely, definitely have had bouts of that. Um, but nowadays it's dry cool though. Like I haven't really had too, too much bad nausea, nothing like that. My fatigue has been better. I have more energy. Um, when I do have energy, it's more energy than, um, before I have more energy than not. I have more good days than not with the nausea. So let's just put it that way. My boobs, <sighs> bruh, them shits is getting worse by the day. Um, I feel like I don't see any end in sight. Them, them joints is like, ugh. I've never felt my boobs hurt this bad before. Like, I could give somebody a hug and my titties are hurt. You know what I'm saying? Like, these guys here, like, laying how I'm laying now, I'm not really laying on them. Like, I'm propped up on my elbows. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not really flat on my stomach either. I don't, y'all probably not going to be able to tell or no shit like that. But I'm not, like, on my stomach. I'm really not. Like, my bed is very soft and, you know, and I'm still really early. So, I'm not uncomfortable. I'm not uncomfortable. I'm not hurting the baby. I'm fine. Okay? Um, ignore my surroundings because I'm doing laundry, changing sheets over and stuff like that. So, my bed's not made and I'm just like kicking it this is the blanket that needs to go on my bed and clothes 
I'm listen, when I tell y'all impromptu, bitch, pick up the camera and tell these folks something. <laughs> Cause I got people worried, like, damn girl, is you still pregnant? Like, what happened? Are you okay? Did you miscarry? Did what's going on? You all right? I'm fine. I'm fine. Baby's fine. We're good. Okay, so what's the next thing that's been going on? Um, saliva. My mouth has been so juicy. I have had the juiciest mouth. Like, I was reading in the end service because, you know, they ask somebody, well, you know, can somebody else read while we demonstrate, you know, whatever, whatever. And so I'm reading why they demonstrate in the moves or whatever because in my line of business, sometimes we got to do takedowns, you know. I am being careful. At the house that I work at, I do not have to take anybody down. I work with older people. We don't have to take anybody down. So, with that being said, um, I we, we still got to practice it. I still got to be up to date on it. I still have to be current. So, you know, I'm reading the paper and everything like that. And when I tell you, it's like I'm reading and it's like my mouth is so drooly and like, I just got to keep swallowing and, and pausing because, like, even right now, like, I got to keep swallowing and pausing because my mouth is mad juicy. So, I'm like, that's another thing, too. Like, I got the water mouth. Like, my mouth is juicy. So, you know, how's that bay like it? <laughs> um, What else? What else, y'all? I told y'all about my boobs. I told y'all about my mouth being juicy. I, I be having to think because I don't write nothing down. You know what I'm saying? Which I need to start writing stuff down. Baby is the size of a fig. Baby is the size of a fig. About that big or something like that. Um, I can kind of feel where my uterus is changing a little bit. Where it's starting to become more firm. Um, I am feeling that. But like I said, I'm a heavier girl, so you're not going to be able to see a bump. If I was super skinny, I'm sure you'd be able to start to see where it's starting to form a little bit. But I'm not super skinny. I've always been big, so you ain't going to see it. <laughs> you're just not going to see it. It's pretty much non-existent right now. Um, but to me, shit, the moment I got pregnant, uh -uh, that's, that ain't fat no more. That's all, baby. <laughs> Let me tell it. <laughs> Shoot, let me tell it. I'm showing. Okay? Let me tell it. But, you know, that's just me. Um, But to other people, like, I feel like if other people can't tell right off the bat that I'm pregnant, then I'm not showing it. That's how, just like with the pregnancy test, if somebody who's not trying to conceive can see that line, then it's a positive. Speaking of that, how y'all doing out there? All, the, all of my sisters that's still trying. Y'all okay? Y'all hanging in there? Keep hanging in there, y'all. Keep trying. Keep hanging in there. It's going to happen, okay? I ain't forgot about y'all. Send the love, y'all. And I got y'all in my heart sending my thoughts, okay? It's going to be okay. Now just keep hanging in there. It's a process. It's a process. For all my girls that's going through IVF and that's thinking about going through IVF and, you know, those of you who haven't quite made it there yet but you're still temping and you're still OPKing, Sis, don't give up. I'm still here with you. You know, it's just that I'm on a different part of the journey. And it is still a journey. You know what I'm saying? I feel freaking weird. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel weird. Like, I know I'm pregnant, but I feel weird pregnant. Like, I feel so weird. Like, my body feels different. You know what I'm saying? Like, my smell is not off. I don't have any, like, cravings. More than anything, I have food aversions. Like, I be starting to eat something and then don't want it. Um, I just really, it's not much. Like, I swear to y'all, it's not much that's going on. It's not much that's different. Weeks 9 and 10, 8, 9 and 10, weeks 8, 9 and 10 have all been the same. Boobs hurting, waves of nausea, haven't thrown up yet. Um, and so far, I guess so far, so good. Pretty good pregnancy so far. Pretty good first trimester so far. I've been having, like, you know, little little sicknesses and stuff there. I, I get cramps every here and again, you know, but I like cramp and then it'll stop and then it'll go away. And then, of course, I'm going to the bathroom checking to see if I'm bleeding. And I'm, I'm not bleeding and nothing like that, so... And then I won't cramp again. You know what I'm saying? Like, my baby's growing. Um, baby's doing fine because I feel like shit. So, baby's doing great. Um, I got a couple tests coming up. 
I have to do, I'm going to be considered high risk because I have high blood pressure, which is controlled. I have controlled high blood pressure. So it's going to automatically put me in a high risk category. So we got that going. Um, I'm going to have to do like this P test where they want me to we in a jug for 24 hours to check my levels of protein or whatever the hell. So I'll be doing that. And then I'm also going to be going to the hospital to get a, um, a fetal test because I am 33. I'm going to go and get tested for Down syndrome and stuff like that. So, well, my doctor offered it. So I'm going to go ahead and do that um, and get that out the way. There's really not much else that I could really tell y'all because I really don't have much else going on. Babe's really excited. He's really excited. He's really happy. Um, his family's really happy, really excited. Like I said, we had some sad news and everything that, you know, this past year has been a rough year with COVID and everything like that. And with deaths, close deaths in the family and stuff like that. You know, our child is very, 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 very welcome right now. You know what I'm saying? So it's like a really bright light at the end of a very dark tunnel so we're excited about that he's very excited about that like i said before i won't be having him in my vlogs because that causes trouble in relationships i've seen it thousands of times over and over again it causes issues and i'm not going to be having babe up in these joints um i'm really trying to get everything out there like i'm really trying to think about every single thing i think i told y'all everything I'm still at work i haven't you know obviously because i'm still in my first trimester i haven't gone out or anything like like that yet excuse me sorry gassy too i've been real gassy I'm burping a lot um i think that's the only thing to really tell y'all is that i'm fine baby's fine i'm still pregnant and i'm about to be 11 weeks um so i guess this will be my eight nine and ten update i'm so sorry i ain't shit i ain't shit i'm sorry and I had to do it like this because, bruh, when else was I going to do this? Like, for real. Like, if y'all don't, listen, if I don't pick up my phone and record on my phone and just straight upload it without the editing, without all the extra pizzazz that I like to put on my videos, then, bruh, it won't get out. Because that's honestly what I'm waiting to do. I'm waiting to find the right time to set up my light, to set up the camera, to sit down. Like, I'm trying to find the time to do all of that. And I'm not going to ever find the time to do that because I am a busy person. I have a lot going on. So, ta-da! <laughs> ta-da! This is what you got to get. This right here. And, you know, I can't wait till my hair is done because I'm going to take my hair out. So, I can't wait till the hair is done. Can't wait till the makeup is done. And I'm supposed to be getting in the shower right now. Like, that's what I'm supposed to I'm supposed to be putting these clothes up and getting in the shower right now. So, I got to, like, kind of, I just was like, let me just come on here real quick. Let me just drop a few lines and let y'all know what's going on. Let y'all know I'm still good. Let y'all know we still here. We're still pregnant. We're still good. We're we're still good to go. So, you know, I love you guys. I have not forgotten about you guys. Um, it's just that I've been so incredibly busy that it's literally ridiculous. I have not been sick or anything like that. I am fine. I am okay. Baby Fuller is okay. We are fine. I'm just ain't shit. <laughs> just ain't shit that's all that is is that i'm just not shit when it comes to picking up this camera but i am getting better at it and i just had to drop this in for y'all real quick so until next time when i'm able to really like sit down and really talk to y'all i don't know when i'm gonna come back i'm sorry i don't know i don't know maybe next time i come back i'll show y'all my little fat stomach i don't know it ain't nothing near though y'all i swear i swear it ain't nothing near it's just fat it's really not nothing there all right um but i'll keep you guys updated and posted on what's going on i love you aunties i will talk to y'all later bye <laughs>